Hello and welcome back my wonderful viewers and subscribers and supporters of this beautiful channel. We are back to The Witcher 3 The Wild Hunt. We've just killed this griffin, taken its head off, and placed it upon this horse. We're going to go take it back to this garrison and get some information from the commander there. I want to thank you guys for, for joining in on this wonderful adventure. This has been loads of fun. This game is a lot different than I expected it to be. It, it plays a lot like uh, other games in the past that I've played, which I, one of my favorites, uh, Shadow of Mordor. Uh, it's kind of like it's some kind of combination of of like a Lord of the Rings plus a plus a uh, power should draw from it. What is it? I'm distracted. I'm distracted, guys. Uh, plus like a, a like a Game of Thrones. Yeah, 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 just like that. And uh, it's loads of fun. I mean, it's smooth. The the combat's nice. It's 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 not like, glitchy and jumpy everywhere. I keep getting stuck on other people's horses, but that's to be expected, I suppose. Uh, that garrison in the background, that's where we're going. And I really do, I really do appreciate the love and support that I have been receiving. Ah, and way. it helps me have the willpower, per se, to do this. This is lots of fun to me to, to play. And to, and to play with you guys and to and to experience this doing push-ups let's whoa. see if we can get off here anyway enough of this weird sentimental feelings and crap Ugh. can't deal with it it's too much for me to handle and I'm curious guys when oh I'll ask later my bad What the hell is this? Why? You take me for a blind man or a fool? This grain is rotten. No, I, I didn't know. So, a fool. Damn it, you never learn. Military Codex, Article 2, Section 3. For the delivery of defective goods, 15 lashes with a knout. Make it so. No, no, no! By the gods, no! What? Fulfilled my end of the bargain. Your turn. Where'd Yennefer go? To Vizima. She was a day's ride from here the whole time? Under my nose? Might have said so. Yes, I might have. But you would not have killed the griffin. Tit for tat. Halt! We are not done. It's yours, this gold. I would not want you to say you were inadequately compensated. Time constraint options. Make a quick decision, okay. Uh, take the coin. Obviously. I'm greedy. It's true. Alright guys. We're gonna continue on with this madness. Let's do this. Let's see, where is it? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see what Mr. Vesemir's gotta say for himself. You know, last time I was in this pub, Whatever you want to call it. Bad stuff happened. Yennefer's in Vizima. Got a few friends there, so... Something wrong? Look around. Trouble brewing. Time we were on our way. Mm-hmm. I'll buy some provisions for the journey. Then we'll go. Geralt. We should stay out of it, just this once.
What happened to the lilies? Took them down. Took them down? To hang a golden sun there now? I cannot show Temerian colours. They'll come and burn the tavern down. Maybe it's true what they say. You fund of the Imperials. You Nilfgaard's whore. Well, let that pass. I know grief eats at your heart. You know shit. They hanged my sister, dragged her out the cloister like a dog. Said Nilfgaard's no place for superstition. That they don't fear the wrath of the gods. And you, do you fear it? If not for Annie, your child would have choked on its navel string. You owe your son to Let my sister attending to the birth, and you don't oh. fear the gods' wrath. You don't oh. fear it, you cunt! Oh. Oh. Leave me be! Recognize this medallion? You know what it means. Back off. You all right? They say witches steal young'uns. That's true. What the Emperor promise you, freaks? Your own land? Like he did the elves once? Get out, all of you. We ain't going nowhere. And neither are you. They won't back down now. I can see that. Are you kidding? Oh, you better back out. See if I can do one of those. Oh, it's not working. Never mind. Come on, come on. Don't be like that. It's all right. It's over. Leave me be! Get away! See his face! God save us! Be gone, and don't ever come back! <laughs> so much for not getting involved. Come on, let's go. Started. Excuses, excuses. You've not changed a bit. Y Yen? How? I received a report about a witcher who'd appeared in White Orchard. I knew it was you, looking for me. I might have waited until you found me, but... Oh, you know me. Patience has never been my strong suit. It's... Good to see you, Geralt. I... I'd even embrace you. Were you not covered in blood? Sorry. I wasn't expecting to see you. To be honest, this isn't at all how I imagined we'd meet. How did you imagine it? He didn't imagine you'd have a Nilfgaardian escort. Don't get me wrong, Yennefer. I'm glad to see you, but I do think you owe us an explanation. And I shall provide it, in Vizima. Ready your horses. Spent the last six months in the saddle. Haven't seen you for two years. Can we take a moment to- Sadly, we cannot. Someone awaits you, Geralt. Someone who doesn't like to be kept waiting. Emperor Emir Var Emrys. Or to those on more intimate terms with him, the white flame dancing on the graves of his foes. Doubt I number among that group. For as I remember, last time we saw each other, he wanted to kill me. Well, now he wishes to make you an offer. The kind one can't refuse? I didn't, though I could have. Must have been a damn good offer then. Not many things you'd give up your freedom for. And even fewer people. The sooner we set off, the sooner you'll find out. What about you? I'm going in the opposite direction. I somehow doubt the Emperor's invitation mentioned me. 
Besides, I've got things to do at Kaer Morhen, remember? Yeah, I remember. Thanks for your help, Fezimir. See you soon. How's your horse? Swift? Can't complain. Why do you ask? I'd like to be back behind some thick city walls, as soon as possible. Filthy. Just the beginning. But then. But then. <laughs> this tomorrow, all right? After the audience. It must suffice. Think of your cares if I'm clean. The gentleman will refer to His Imperial Majesty by his full title or not at all. The gentleman will be seated on the bergère. The what now? In that chair. This is twice you've seen him shirtless. Catherine, glistening. Shave the gentleman sideburns to half an inch. What's wrong with my beard? Always thought it added to my dignity. It does. Yet it also detracts from your elegance. In Nilfgaard, we consider beards hard on the eyes. Especially beards infested with lice. Been on the road a while. Fine. Do your thing. Tilt your head back, please. And sit still. How goes it? Preparations for the audience proceeding as planned. Yes, General. The gentleman will be more or less presentable. Who's this guy? He a barber too? No. Morvran Voris, commander of the Alba Division. Yennefer's escort. They were my men. All of them. Indeed, were. For none have returned to visit, have they? I truly wonder what happened on the road yesterday. Perhaps you could enlighten me. You have time. And, uh, razor to your throat. 
Wild Hunt killed them. A cavalcade of wraiths dashing across the night sky. These omens of war, the peasantry bubbles about. Expect me to believe that. Frankly, I don't really give a damn. Nordlings, we can bathe you, shave you, and clothe you, but teaching you manners, that will be a challenge. Nice meeting you too. Done. Shall I shave him once more, against the grain? No. He himself is very much against the grain. That's enough. Farewell, Witcher. Or rather, see you soon. Good. Now the gentleman may dress. Sadly, I did not receive exact measurements. If the garments chafe, our tailor will adjust them. Black, black, or black. We do not like garish colors in Nilfgaard. The gentleman will tell me once he has chosen an outfit. I think I'm gonna go with the black one. <laughs> okay, let's look at this. Got kind of goldish stuff. The downward dudes. This one. If I can even get it. Come on. Loot. And I guess I dress up, right? Maybe? Oh, baby, do I look fresh. At least they didn't take my, uh, my meat off of me. <laughs> oh, and man. they say clothes do not make the man. Does the outfit satisfy the gentleman? A studded doublet and a sword on my back. That's what would satisfy me. But tough. When in Nilfgaard. Yes. It's a saying. So what now? Powder my nose? No need. The gentleman's complexion is light enough. The gentleman is to stand before the ruler of the north and south. I must confirm that he knows how to bow. Confirm away. Please watch. Leg extended. Hand flat. Head down. Chin to chest. The gentleman will rehearse. Hmm. Lacking fluidity and grace. But we've learned to expect less of Nordlings. Come with me. This dude just needs to chill out, man. The gentleman will address the Emperor only when asked to, and using the appropriate title. Your Arch Magnificency. I see the gentleman is in the mood for jests. I fear the Emperor might not share his disposition. Your Majesty will suffice. Spoken loudly, clearly, and with respect. Daifen Aden in Karn Eb Marvut, Emir Var Emreis. Bow. Better bow. Dude will get pissed. Our new friend. Your Imperial Majesty. Arer Eb the Orde. A valiant namen, what can favort? I thought you bowed before no man. Didn't want to disappoint the Chamberlain. We're friends.
Take it you didn't summon me to reminisce about the good old days, so... Silence. My daughter Cyrilla, she's returned. And she's in danger. The wild hunt pursues her. You will find her and bring her to me. How many men in your army? Twenty thousand? Thirty? So why me? You know why. Because she trusts you. She trusts me, yes. So tell me why you're looking for her. Doubt it's about making up for all those lost years. For reasons of state, as always. Enough of this banter. You will agree regardless. If for no other reason than because I shall pay you. More than you customarily receive for a contract. Considerably more. I need information, not motivation. Siri leaves few tracks. She'll be hard to find. My core of spies will help you. Count on them and my army, should the need arise. Yennefer will tell you the rest. This audience is finished. Meredith! Take him to the sorceress. Follow me, if the gentleman pleases. Please keep close. There are many honorable guests in the palace, whom the gentleman... Disgusts. ...need not bother. First thing in the morning, and it's it past Kercher. noon. It's dancing, sir. And in current at Morphal. What? It's a pretty detailed uh, building here. I'm Herivard, the second Prince of Elan. Interesting the ceiling paintings. This dude walks so slow. I can't do it. The gentleman will be super annoyed. It's your slowness, sir. <laughs> oh, this guy. Once the gentleman is done, he should see me to retrieve his possessions. Okay. Let's go see sexy pants. Oh, I can run, yes. Geralt, that tunic. You look positively smashing. Ugh, dying to take it off. I'd consider that a proposition under different circumstances. One I might even take you up on. But we've matters to attend to. Now do you understand why I'm at Emir's court? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. And seems we're in the same boat now. Siri, she's really back? No chance he's mistaken? Look, that's more or less what she looks like now. Or so our agents claim. Our little witch has grown into a young lady. How about that? She's grown up. It's been years since you trained together at Kaer Morn. A great deal has changed. You haven't? Not a bit? <laughs> I missed those awkward compliments of yours. But let's focus on Ciri, alright? Right. Amir said the Wild Hunt's after her. I'd find that hard to believe, before what happened yesterday. How did they track us down? Because of me. You see, I've spent months searching for Ciri. Using locating spells, haruspicy, geomancy, anything, really. I knew the Wild Hunt might sense it, perhaps even find me, but... I thought I'd trick them. Well, guess you were wrong. Hmm. I've sensed them on my trail, hunting me, for some time. If not for you and Amir's soldiers, they'd have gotten what they were after. I can't risk another encounter like that. It's time to put away the magic, turn to more traditional methods. To the best tracker I know. You must find her, Geralt. Before the Wild Hunt does. So where has Ciri been seen, exactly? In two places. 
Velen and Novigrad. The trail in Velen is most promising. You should make that your first stop. Ask for a merchant named Hendrik at the inn at the crossroads. One of the Emperor's agents. He should get in touch with you. That's it? No passwords? Secret handshakes? None. Sorry to spoil your fun. Your boyhood fantasies about the crafts of the trade. All we have in Novigrad are unconformed reports, rumors. But there you will have the help of our mutual acquaintance. Triss Merigold. Apparently she's got a cozy flat on the main square. Sure she'll be delighted to see me. What about you? What will you do? I shall sail for Skellige. There was a magic explosion there recently, blew half a forest down. I believe this had something to do with Ciri. I'll be in care trolled. Join me there once you've learned something. One thing before we go. Why didn't you contact me? Didn't need me? Didn't even want to see me? I didn't want to spoil things. I'd heard you and Triss made a great couple. Yen, I'd lost my memory. Really? That's your excuse? Let's drop it, all right? It's not what you think, or it helped me understand how much I love you. I don't wish to hear it. Any of it. Guess this means we need to split up again. Not my preference, but I understand. Clock's ticking. It is indeed. So why don't I teleport you to Velen, get you there at once? Not gonna happen. I'll go on horseback, as soon as I can get changed. Have it your way? Oh, and... You really look quite dashing in black velvet. Think so? Maybe I can have some of my armor lined with it. <laughs> Good luck, Yen. Same to you. And if you wish to learn what's happened in the world while you and Vesemir roam the wilderness, talk to Ambassador Vartra. That's him over there. And Geralt, I know it's wartime, but try not to be a hero, all right? Just check those leads and come back to me, in one piece. I shall be waiting. Oh, baby. Oh, do I get to leave this forsaken place? Please, please, please. A shame I have no time. So this is kind of an interesting uh, situation we got going here. How might I serve the gentleman? By returning my things. Citrus and cloves. The fragrance will keep the gentleman's robes fresh somewhat longer. Mm. Thanks, Bunches. Thanks, Amber is not known for Bunches? His he wants his daughter back safe and sound. As soon as possible. Yeah. Mentioned something of the sort. So long. Did this dude just say I thanks, Bunches? <laughs> what? <laughs> Sorry, I just find that very comical. Quest available? Let's go look at that. Oh wait. I have to leave, don't I? And then I can pick it. Oh, I'm already here? What? Alright, let's go back. Let's go see what's going on. Is there a magical quest in here? Oh. Mm. See ya. Just kidding. I don't want to play Gwent. I'm out of here. Sorry. Sorry for the uh, distraction there. Hanged man's tree, shall we? Geralt and Yennefer were reunited, but something even more important happened in Vizima. Geralt learned that Cirilla, his one-time ward, had returned from afar, and she was in danger. He was to find her, at the Emperor's command and Yennefer's behest.
guess it's called the hanging tree for a reason, right? Of these dead people. How'd they hang that dude way up there? Goodness. Alright guys, I'm ending it here. Uh, thanks for watching, really appreciate it. Again, like and subscribe, really help. The better this does, the... If, if this video does well, I'll, I'll probably keep it going. Because it's going to be a really long game. I mean, I hear that there are 200 hours of gameplay if you do everything. But if you just bust through the story, it's like 25 hours, something like that. Uh, well, in any case, I'll see you guys next time.